Have you ever been told you couldn't do something you knew in your heart you could? There's no stopping Taylor Green. Look at the intensity in her eyes. Did it make you doubt yourself? I don't know that this guy can be stopped. Or maybe think that's way too hard for me. She is country strong. She just dominated the world. Wall. On this course, there are no limits to what can be accomplished. Incredible. If you can dream it's gonna it. It's going to be a warp wall showdown. You can do it. And these athletes are here to prove it. What a comeback. These are ninja warriors. And they, that ninja is strong, have come to play. Watch out. Sammy's coming back. It all happens right now. Ninja Warrior Jr. Welcome to sunny downtown Los Angeles, where the qualifying rounds of American Ninja Warrior Jr. continue. Hello, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Matt Eisman. And I'm Akbar Baja Biamilla. Before this competition began, I was asked time and again if it was fair to have the girls compete against the boys. Well, if last time told us anything, maybe the question should really be, is it fair for the boys? 10-year-old Taylor Green. Effortless out of Taylor Green. 12-year-old Autumn Matheson. She just made that jump from her knees. And 13-year-old Sophia LaBelle. She came back from behind. Showed us that girl power isn't just an expression, it's a way of life, as all three moved on to represent their age groups in the semifinals. And today, four more junior ninjas from each age bracket have converged to battle it out on our dual obstacle course all vying for a $15,000 grand prize and the title of American Ninja Warrior Junior Champion. As a reminder, each qualifying round will feature four competitors per age group. Yeah, those four competitors will meet for the first time in the seeding round. Then the two fastest ninjas will face off against the two slowest in the knockout round. And that'll set up one final showdown to determine who moves on to the semifinals. You can feel the energy. There's enough electricity here to power the whole city. Well, let's get to it. Starting it off once again will be the Junior Ninjas from the 9 and 10 year old age bracket. And for a closer look at their course, let's go down to our co-host, Lori Hernandez. Thanks, guys. As always, the 9 and 10 year old Ninjas will begin their side-by-side -side race right here at the Sonic Swing. Then the Ninjas will use all their momentum on the TikTok. After that, they'll need their upper body strength to scale the bottom of the I-beam. That's followed by a quick run over the floating tiles. Then they'll need to lache through the spin cycle without falling off. And finally, the junior ninjas will need to face the 13-foot warp wall with handholds at 10 and 11 and a half feet. First ninja to hit their buzzer wins the race. Matt? Thanks, Lori. Well, it's time to kick things off on American Ninja Warrior Junior leading out with our nine and 10-year-old warriors. First up, we have nine-year-old Alyssa Cerula out of Mount Laurel, New Jersey. And she's squaring off against Peyton Myler out of Harriman, Utah. The Milers, the only family to be represented in every age group, doubly so here in 9 and 10. We're going to see Peyton first and then her twin brother Paxton in this 9 and 10-year-old group. People in my neighborhood call us a fun family, but online, we're called the Ninja Kids. We upload videos at least once a week. I have so much fun being in all these videos because, like, I get to spend more time with my family. In a year and a half, we've made just over 60 videos, and we have about 800 million views. 800 million times! That's a lot. I have three brothers and zero sisters. <laughs> my oldest brother is Brighton, and he's 14. Oh, yeah! Ashton was 12. And Paxton is my twin. There is never a dull moment in the Myler house. They've been training martial arts and gymnastics their whole life. My kids can seriously turn a picnic into a full-blown ninja frenzy. Peyton kind of does awesome as the only girl. The best thing about being the only girl is I don't have to share my room and I don't have to share my clothes. Peyton definitely is powerful and feisty and she has tons of energy. I may be the only girl, but I'm strong and I'm fast and I'm gonna get it done today. I expect we'll see a lot of great performances out of the Ninja Kids. They look intimidating, and Peyton is no exception, but Alyssa's a fierce athlete who plays basketball and soccer. And get this, she won her first Ninja competition after just two months of training, two months. Peyton Myler, the only girl in her family, she keeps up with the boys, and a good start for both of them. Yeah, that's right, Matt, Alyssa and Peyton really pushing it. 
Alyssa looks a little caught up in the cargo net. There you go. Look at that leap though to Peyton Myler. Just 4-1 right up onto the IB. Come on, girls. There's Come mentor on. Barclay Stockett giving encouragement. And these two very close. Let's watch this dismount. Myler off first. But here comes Alyssa, taking her time, sizing up the floating tiles. You gotta have confidence and wiggles through the floating tiles. It requires agility and balance. This spin cycle is really gonna test their range. These are long reaches. They'll really need to swing to gain momentum here. Look at that, though. Peyton's doing it like a pro. Alyssa's got that momentum going, but she needs to make that transition. Peyton Myler, tremendous grip strength. Well, Alyssa's not giving up, but she's got to move. Well, we've seen someone four foot two get up the wall before. And we just saw it again. Did you see her gymnastic form on the run? Well, she is proving she is a ninja kid. We might have getting that win. You can see the difficulty controlling the momentum on the spin cycle. And Alyssa splashes down. Tremendous effort, though. Way to go, Peyton Myler. You just delivered. I think you just showed your brothers who the real ninja kid is, right? No, I can see why the Ninja Kids have 800 million views. Just look at how Peyton throws herself at those baskets on Spin Cycle. Being 4 for one that's the only way to do it. Just incredible. Peyton Myler takes the win, and there she is getting some love from her Ninja family. Here again today to coach the athletes are our all-star mentors. Najee Richardson will be helping out the 11 and 12-year-olds, Kevin Bull, the 13 and 14-year-olds, and then there's Barclay Stockton at the start line with our next two competitors for the nine and 10 year olds. Any nerves that you guys have, use those to help you on the course. Nerves aren't bad, they help you, okay? Use those nerves, got it? Yeah. All right, stick to the plan guys, y'all got this. Click subscribe to get more American Ninja Warrior Junior. Subscribe below, do it right now. Give a thumbs up for your favorite ninja. Hey, and if you think you're a warrior, tell us why in the comments.